Melanation Gang. Let's try, let's try, let's try. This girl, I am Ruby Nova. Back with another Intuitive Time with me, y'all. If you are new to the channel, I'm a little bit raunchy, but you can stick around and see I'm your cup of tea. Also, what comes up comes out. It does not need to appear. Um, and welcome to the channel. So go ahead and smash those buttons. You need to be smashing. All right. All right, all right, all right. And welcome to the Melanation and everything. All right. It is April 2nd, 11.39 on the clock. All right. It's going to be a spirit baby reading. So, Von Oswe. Von, yeah, Von Oswe. Good evening, good evening, good evening. Yeah. God grant us the serenity of the things that we cannot change, the courage to change things that we can. And the wisdom to know the difference. I said, God grants us certainty to set the things that we cannot change. The courage to change the things that we can. And the wisdom to know the difference. Asha, Asha, Asha. Yeah. Anybody sending any evil eye towards me in my collective, please return that shit back to center with the center of knowledge. Anybody sending any evil eye towards me in my collective, please return that shit back to center with the center of knowledge. And please clear all the spirits that will be Going on, guys. So this is a highly divine message. It's been sirens all day. Fire trucks. Two fifty-five on my clock. Going to the store once or three, and I just need some more food. So this is a part of the tour. Look at how it resonates. Where is some of my collective from? That's going to be resonating with the spirit baby message. Where is some of my people from? Alaska 907. Where are some of my people from that are going to be resonating with the spirit baby message? Haiti. You could be from Dubai or live somewhere else because it came out in the reverse. Or one of you guys could be from Dubai, I think it how it resonates. Where some of 355 on the clock? Where is some of my people from resonating with this message? 773, Chicago, Illinois. Can we get one more spirit? Thank you. Guatemala. All right. I'm hearing like some of y'all could be back and forth from the states into y'all countries. Okay, check out how it resonates. What do my people do for work in Alaska? What do my people do for work in Alaska? Also, if my voice is going in and out, you guys, I'm so sorry, but. Again, I live in the Midwest, the weather is crazy, so I have really bad allergies. My allergies be flaring because of that. Okay, I'm sorry. <coughs> I'm trying. 
What do my people do for work in Alaska? Okay, it said sneaky links and secrets. Sneaky links and secrets, something about after hours. Okay, so this could be um, some type of security, um, casinos, clubs, um, actual after hours bars. Um, you could be the person doing the sneaky linking or you could be a person observing other people doing this because this would be like hotel work, um, you know, um, resorts type work. This is where like a lot of people go and just do sneaky link type shit. You feel what do my people in Haiti do for work? What do my people in Haiti do for work? What do my people in Haiti do for work? Everything on the company. Food catering. Okay, so somebody works for food in um haiti somebody's probably like um uses money to do other things <laughs> like pay for other things using their money from that i don't know but they could be the owner of it or something entrepreneurship What do my people in Dubai do for work? What do my people in Dubai do for work? I just see military brat, so somebody could be a military brat. Company charity tailgating. Penny pincher. Do you really need this or are you a hoarder? Someone's trash is someone's treasure. Okay, so somebody could be like, um, somebody could be like, um, one of those people that like, um, they spend money crazy because we all know that in Dubai, like, it's for like people that have like a lot of money and stuff like that. So these could be like, People that go through people's closets and redo, like, um, revamp their closets and get rid of stuff and do, like, charities and stuff with them, like, support and stuff. Like, you know, you're only going to buy this once or at one time. Like, just go ahead and give it to somebody who's going to wear it or back to charity or do fashion shows, you know, that type of charities and things of that sort. So, okay. What do my people in Chicago, Illinois do for it? What do my people in Chicago, Illinois do for work? What do my people in Chicago, Illinois do for work? Eight thirty-three on the clock. What do my people in Chicago do for work? Spirit pertaining to the spirit of meeting. What do my people in Chicago, Illinois do for work pertaining to the spirit of meeting? Meeting, thank you. Okay. Local housing commission based on income housing. Okay, so somebody could just um, not be working at all or something, or somebody could work with the um, Section 8 office. Like um, local work, take it however it resonates. Um, this could be somebody who lives in um local housing community, and they do like volunteer work around the building or something like that as well. Take it how it resonates, but it's something surrounding local housing commission. Also got district court civil matters and mayor born and raised here. So this could be somebody that works for um the 
the city or the state as well. I'm hearing two people that come from two different worlds. Like, could start um, dating their, or did start dating, like, their, um, what they call them, um, landlord or some shit. I don't fucking know. They get however it's needed. What do my people in Guatemala do for work? What do my people in Guatemala do for work? Forty dollar bullet hole shoes. I'm good. I just want drinks and wings. Shoes. No duffel, no bag. Okay, so in Guatemala, somebody could be working like at a rundown strip club. Cause it said this is where like the bullet hole bitches be at. The forty dollar holes be at. Okay. Whether you are one of the strippers or you run it or you're a bartender, however, bottle girl, waitress, whatever you want to call it, like, somebody works at a rundown strip club. All right. <laughs> that is crazy. I just like to, like, just figure out what everybody's lifestyle is. Okay, how did y'all get into this situation? The lever card on the top of the deck or bottom of the deck, should I say? Okay, so this baby was made out of love. True love. Okay. Now, spirit, what type of energy? <clears throat> what type of energy? My people in Alaska. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody feel like something is like never ending. Like a never ending like race to something. This is somebody who is surrounded by sneaky links and secrets. Okay. Or somebody's like, the money's not enough or something like that to keep these secrets or something like that. Something like, something about the money ain't good to keep these secrets or something. Is what it is. Okay. Okay. So, if this is like something like that, somebody wants to lie about this baby or something like that, they like, this money, whatever, ain't enough for me to like, keep this lie. Or even if you're keeping this life for somebody is. Mm. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> What's going on with what type of energy is my people on in Haiti? What type of energy is my people in in Haiti? Okay. Everything on the company. What type of energy is my people in? Mm, the devil card. So yeah. Somebody is taking, like, the company's money and going on, like, these dates or catering to, like, their personal lifestyle or something like that. Like I said, with this devil card coming out, okay, somebody was taking company money and splurging on someone. Mm. Ooh, child. What's going on with these people in the vibe? What type of energy is these people in in the vibe? Just hang to the spirit to be reading. Okay. Charity. Tailgating. Torch. Penny pinchers. What's going on with these people in the vibe? What type of energy are they in pertaining to the spirit to be reading? You guys could be like trying to get rid of some of the stuff to um, put it towards your baby or something like that. Mm -hmm. Or making space in your house to uh, make it into a nursery. The hair of fox. Yeah. Getting clarity and getting help on what to do, what not to keep, what to keep. Um, you know, getting a second opinion. Ain't nothing wrong with that. 
Also, this could be like somebody um also getting married while pregnant or something like eloping while pregnant. And that's another reason why you guys are probably getting rid of certain stuff so y'all can get ready to move in together, um, put money towards this wedding, you know what I'm saying? Things of that nature. But this Dubai city in reverse might be moving or moving moving from or to Dubai. Okay. What's going on with these people in Chicago, Illinois? What type of energy has these people in Chicago, Illinois? What's going on with these people in Chicago, Illinois? What type of energy are they in? The Eight of Swords on its side. I'm seeing like those movies and stuff. <clears throat> Even the up, even like even like with Medea goes to jail. That's perfect example. Like, it's like two people that come from two different worlds. You know what I'm saying? And this could be something with um a project going on, and they like, nah, like you can't tear down confirmation. You can't like tear that down. Like I grew up there, or I know the people there. Like my family lived there. Like. Y'all trying to build some BS there. Like, I'm not with that. You know what I'm saying? And just like that one movie I just watched recently, I've been posting in some of my readings. It's the message in the messenger. Like, he was trying to tell the preacher, like, you wrong. You know what I'm saying? Like, and pointing out why. And then it led to a domino effect of, like, everybody who had part in, like, doing wrong knowingly or unknowingly type of thing. Like, that's what I'm getting from this. And then I got, like, the two of pentacles in reverse. Like, there's no reason to have to juggle. Like, you know what the fuck is right. Like, you know what the right decision is. Or this could be, like, like I don't want my baby grow up. Like, now, like I understand. Like, it's like, where your people stuff come from, this, this, and that. But I don't want my kids around that or some shit. The high priest in reverse. I'm hearing like somebody's trying to like be controlling and dim somebody's light, and this is still a some type of initiation. I'm hearing um this could be like your first child or something like that. A child is gonna be super enlightened, super intuitive. All this blue on the board pertaining to that. It's a lot of back and forth, back and forth, back and forth about higher level living and lower level living. Like, it's a battle with that. Like, somebody like, okay, like, I, like you done made it now. Like, why like why do you care about some hood shit if you done made it now type of thing? It's still like right is right and wrong is wrong. Mm. Okay. What's going on with these people in Guatemala? What type of energy are they in? Yeah, six of cups in reverse. They don't want to give out. Okay, I'm hearing like somebody could have been like working in type of club or something like that, ended up pregnant, but like, like this person had no business being in this club. Like, that's why they really not trying to give to the situation. The hermit in reverse. Like, somebody wants to shed light on this. Somebody wants to shed light on this so bad. Once they do shed light on it, it's going to be a whole new world, a whole new different ball game. But somebody could be upset that they got somebody who works in a strip club pregnant or something of that sort. Look at how it resonates. Yeah, because I even got seven of cups in reverse as well. Like, 
Like, there's nothing to think about. Like, no, I don't want to get to this place. Somebody's like, being upset. Like, one person over here, like, daydreaming about all the stuff they about to have with this person. And the other person, like, you have to get all of that out of your head because this is not even that. That is messed up. That's messed up. That's not cool. But it's like, what's I be saying? Like, don't be so quick to just. I was out there and just be rushing on people because then you end up with kids and then if you don't know the person like that or really can't stand that person or can only be intoxicated around this person or for whatever reason, like y'all not really compatible like that because y'all never took the time to get to know each other. Like, mm, 2044 on the clock, y'all. What kind of rhythm? is this baby okay so so far let's get this out the way so i want y'all to be confused okay so so far let me look my phone <coughs> my people in alaska 907 <coughs> either you are a sneaky link or know about a sneaky link and be around sneaky linky things okay that's your occupation like like i said whether you work around clubs casinos bars um excursion type stuff like where you're gonna see like a lot of shit or whatever country clubs whatever anywhere you can go on an outing be sneaky whatever okay or you are the sneaky link or you are doing these things there is a king of pentacles in reverse like they do not want to get to the situation or whatever they're giving to the situation keep it a secret is not enough Okay, it's not enough. People in Haiti. Somebody in Haiti was splurging the company's money on a baddie. Okay? They was taking that company money and splurging it on a baddie, okay? With this devil card. Like, like on some the devil made him do it. I'm seeing um what's it be dazzled. <laughs> I'm seeing that movie Be Dazzled and I'm seeing the TV show Lucifer. Yeah, like somebody was out here just doing the most with the company's money. Now they're gonna have to try to keep up that whatever they're doing because now it's the baby on the way. This girl thinking like you got it like that. Or maybe you could have got it like that, but it's some fluff on it. All right, my people in the spy. Okay, somebody is trying to figure out how to rearrange their life with the hair file coming out. They're going to be trying to get help with um getting rid of this um these items that are no longer being used, but they can still get in like um some good money out of it. This could be somebody moving in together. This could be marriage while pregnant. Um, also, people, you guys are just working on charity, period, okay? With the hair fine, there's going to be some type of togetherness or initiation between you guys that is um, very well established, like fine print type shit. And I feel like somebody's going to be moving because new vibes is in the reverse, like somebody's moving or something, Okay. Mm -hmm. Chicago, Illinois, 773. It's some type of uptown versus downtown type of thing going on. Um, somebody can work for the city or the state. Somebody comes from nothing with this um, local housing community, Section 8. Okay. Home is what you make it. Again, with this, somebody could be moving as well, but we got the Eight of Swords on his side. Like, there's nothing to think about, like, do what's right type of energy. Also, the Two of Pentacles, like, you know where the fuck to put the money at, like, stop playing. Also seeing the Norbit, too, with this as well. And then I got the High Priestess in reverse, like, somebody's light is being dimmed at this time, or trying to be dimmed at this time. Or somebody's being very strategic on the way that they move. Because I'm seeing some shit like, motherfuckers are going to go one way. But like I said, with that, do the right thing. 
at last minute they gonna do what the fuck is supposed to be right or something. Take it how it resonates. But yeah, somebody already comes for money. Somebody don't, but they still made it to money. But like I was saying, they, they like, why do you care so much if you made it? And it's like, that's not right. You want to do the right thing. Guatemala. Somebody works in a strip club that is like not one of the best strip clubs. Ended up pregnant. Whoever they pregnant by does not want to give to them. They don't want to shed light on this, but like it's going to be shed on this with the hermit in reverse. Um, but we got the six of cups in reverse. Um, hermit in reverse. We got the um world card. Like so, and no matter how it goes, like it's coming out that this person is pregnant. But it's not going to go like how this person thinks it's going to go. Like, because whoever it is is upset that they got whoever pregnant. Again, this could be another situation where people come from two different worlds. What type of energy will this child be bringing to this situation? Are my people in Alaska? What type of energy? Will this baby be bringing my people in Alaska? This very baby reading. Jazz. The tap dancer, jazz. Your bright soul needs more upbeat music. <laughs> so they're going to be jazzing up everything. I'm hearing your baby is going to be a busybody. Because you see all this stuff and what's going on and all of that. Your baby is going to be a fast learner, quick on their toes. Okay, give me one second. Okay, yeah, my bad, y'all. <laughs> um, my allergies, I cannot. Okay, so yeah, they're gonna be jazzing up your life. Okay, in Alaska, for my people in Haiti, what type of energy is this baby going to be bringing into you guys? What type of energy is this baby going to be bringing you guys in Haiti? What type of energy is this baby going to be bringing you in Haiti? What type of energy is this spirit baby going to be bringing my people in Haiti? Reggae. Ha! <laughs> Ain't that funny? Honeycomb high out reggae. And you are unforgettable. I need to get you alone. Ooh. Hey. Don't tell nobody. Mm -mm. Yeah. This person gets lost with whoever this is. With this devil card, I said, like, they were spinning bread. It's like so damn bright. They were spinning bread. Like crazy on whoever this baddie is. Batty, batty, shot a clock. <laughs> All right. Ooh, what type of energy is this baby bringing to my people in Dubai? Harry Potter is schooling for highly gifted. Tap in. Okay. So, your child is going to have very, very many gifts. Very, very many gifts. Okay. I'm also hearing something about a boss mitzvah or something or a christening for a baby or however it is that Jewish people do for their baby. A, I'm hearing christening, a christening, a christening or something. Christening. Um, immigration, dreamers, pick a country and go for it. Kids or no kids, dreams come true. So like I said, somebody is moving. Are this moving houses, moving countries, moving states, moving to the other side of town, moving in together, whatever the fuck it is. This this child is causing a move. Upbeat stories, house music, something everyone can enjoy. No need to skip. Okay, this baby is bringing in a lot of joyful energy. So wherever y'all at right now, y'all hoarding a lot of shit. Y'all need fresh new energy. 
Okay, this baby's gonna be bringing in fresh new energy. Something that everybody can love. Like, whatever house and stuff y'all yes, live in right now is not copacetic for a family dynamic. Like, so, yeah. Okay, spirit, thank you. What's going on with my people in Chicago, Illinois? What type of energy will this baby be bringing in? What type of energy will this baby be bringing in Chicago, Illinois? Native songs, country, folk music. I ain't got a deal, but my bars be real. Okay, so I'm hearing your baby gonna have an old soul. Okay. Like, with you being through a lot, and then this person being, like, I don't even want to put it like that. Like, people that were raised in a more, um, I don't want to, like, I don't want to say it in a rude way. Okay, like, I don't want to say, like, damn, how do I say it? People that were raise more privilege. I'm just gonna put it like that. More privilege. And then with your background of being like humble and gratitude because you get it. Your child soul is gonna be like a old ass soul. Like this baby gonna bring in a, to keep both y'all on your toes to make sure both y'all do the right thing. I'm hearing no mommy because and daddy, you're not supposed to. You know what I'm saying? Like your baby, your baby gonna be on your head. Like and you gonna be like, "Hey, I'm a parent." Like who? Like the fuck? But nah, they they mean well. Though. <laughs> What's going on? What type of energy will this baby be bringing to my people in Guatemala? What type of energy will? <clears throat> yeah, y'all get it. Don't worry, be happy, one love, family and community, okay? So your baby is going to bring in harmony. So don't, no matter how much this person tries to fight it, like, <laughs> let's get together, feel all right, yo. You know what I'm saying? Or this person can just be having doubts because it's like, okay, I met this person that's like, this is my baby, da, 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 da. like, but once the baby come and stuff like that, like, they're going to be like, okay, you know what I'm saying? But right now, like, while you're pregnant, you might have a hard pregnancy because the person is just, like, really tripping balls about their situation that they just put themselves through, you know what I'm saying? Then I got church music, Christian, soul voice, gospel. So your baby going to be able to sing. I'm hearing, like, a Mariah Carey voice. Okay, your baby gonna be able gonna have them. I'm hearing you you cried a lot, or you could um, I'm seeing like those music videos where it's like those girls is on stage, like you could be like a showgirl type of entertainer, like where you could sing or something, real good. You pass this down to your child. All right. I'm hearing L is for the way you look at me. Oh, it's for the only one I need. He is very, very uh, extraordinary. He is for every that you adore and love is all that I can give to you. <laughs> okay. What does this baby want to tell its parents in Alaska? Formula. Okay, so you guys might be having to use formula instead of breastfeeding for whatever reason. Do your research on breastfeeding at this time. All right. What does this baby want to tell his parents in Haiti? What does his parent want to tell his parents in Haiti? Information coming in fast. Knowledge of all kinds. Downloads. To be continued. Okay, so right now, if somebody is trying to figure out if they're pregnant, they might be in a two-week wait or something like that, or just not start paying attention to their body or something like that. 
on here. Um, I ain't never playing tricks on me. <laughs> too far. But yeah, somebody could be like, am I in my head about this? You know what I'm saying? Like, go take a test. So yeah, you're about to be getting all type of downloads that you are pregnant in Haiti. All right. Spirit, what's going on with my people in Dubai? What does their baby want to tell them? What does their baby want to tell them? Two week waiting period, zero to three months. Okay, so you guys are also in a um, two week wait as well. Or is this confirmation for Haiti? I feel like this is confirmation because didn't I just say two week waiting period? So can we get some more information for Dubai? Because I'm, I'm going to put this in the middle. I feel like that's for both of y'all. Can we get some more information? What does this baby want to tell its parents in Dubai City, Dubai? This also could be for any of y'all. It don't have to necessarily be these states and countries that you guys are in, but you know what I'm saying? I feel it. Y'all know what the fuck is going on. It's understood. I need to be explained. I'm the same thing. Well, what's going on for my people in Dubai City, Dubai Spirit? What's going on? Big mouth, okay. So your baby is going to have a big mouth, okay. Your baby is always going to have a story, a joke, a song to sing, some information to run down, a question to ask, some knowledge to give. Like your baby gonna be doing <laughs> So get ready, your motherfucker be entertaining you, okay? Twenty five nine. What's going on with my people in Chicago, Illinois? What do they baby want to tell them? Mistress. You knew the deal. Stop fucking playing. Okay. And this also could be for my people in Guatemala. So I'm going to put this in the middle as well. So, yeah. Okay, so somebody could have been creeping with somebody. Like, y'all know how y'all not supposed to, like, Sleep with people that you're not work with or something like that. And this could have been a thing. And then, like, now y'all put heads about this lower income and higher income thing. Or, like I said, with the landlord type of shit. Like, you know what it is. Like, you do me a favor. I pay your rent. Whatever. Take how it resonate. Like, you know your situation. Um, but so, it's something about somebody has the upper hand. And they looking at somebody like they got the lower hand, okay? What is going on with my people in Chicago, Illinois? What does this baby want to tell its parents? What does this baby want to tell its parents? The greatest generation, 1910 to 1924. As of 2022, they will be ages 93 to 107. So this is a reincarnated soul coming back in. This is what this native folk songs, okay, as well. That's making hella sense. That could also be why your child is going to be so like, you know, I ain't got a deal, but my bar to be real. Like, your child is going to be like, I'm seeing, like, how Riley and Huey is on there. Like, how Huey is just always, like, just so stiff. Like, he just be stiff on the mic. He ain't got no time for no game. <laughs> Huey do not be letting up on nobody, okay? And yeah, I've been here before. I will help you grow in life if you allow me to. Okay, confirmation. You have one more on the way. One firstborn, yay. Okay. So this might not be your first child, but this is your first child with this person. So, you know what I'm saying? Because you have one more on the way. Or somebody could be thinking they only pregnant with one person, with one, one kid. And, um, you know what I'm saying? I, I said with one person. So somebody, like, yeah, somebody could be cheating between two people. So I gotta resonate. Okay, but something about somebody been here before. They bring it in truth to you. This is like a mistress sneaky link situation as well. All right.
This is a side note. Somebody needs to use tea to help with fertility. Okay, somebody who's going to be running into this message. Use tea for fertility. Yeah, and then close me out. What's going on with my people in Guatemala? What's going on with my people in Guatemala? What? What does this baby want to tell his parents in Guatemala? What does this spirit baby want to tell his parents in Guatemala? Baker's man, four to six months, second trimester. Ooh. Yeah, ain't no hiding it now. They in a second trimester. This person could start going to church more once they found out how deeper this was or whatever. Okay, yeah, they and that's why another reason why this person didn't make hit because they like, damn, like how long did you know? Why are you just not telling me or whatever like this? But some people really don't be knowing until they like further along. Especially if this is their first baby, so they this man can't be getting mad at you. Hell. It says creating my own blood one. Yeah, this is your first child. So this person could already have a family somewhere, but this is your first child. So again, this person is like upset, or this is both y'all first child, and this person just got like the jitters, but it does come out mistress. So I'm feeling like this person already has a family. That's why it's like there's no room to give you any extra. Again, Nine of Pentacles had already came out. Devil came out. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's no extras to give. Like, what the fuck do you need from me? Like, like somebody, I'm here. I, 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 <laughs> I'm here. I, 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 no. Oh, my goodness. And it says little to no morning sickness. So, yeah, that's why this, you didn't know because you didn't, ha you had little to no morning sickness. So you didn't know until you was in your second fucking trimester as to where some of these people, you know what I'm saying? It was a waiting period or you could have went through this waiting period, whatever. Like I said, the, it doesn't have to necessarily mean you from these countries or whatever. Take what resonates with your situation. Okay. Mm, this is crazy. Okay, we're going to get some motivational messages for mommy and daddy. We're going to get a prayer message, and then we're going to be done. It was just 42, 22 on the clock. I know the fuck that's right. Other parent is active in will and parenting. So they like, they willing to like be an active parent, but they can't really give you no extra like money and shit like this. Hold on, that's making sense. The last generation. Okay, can I get one motivational message for mommy? Alright. Can I get one motivational message for mommy? Can I get one motivational message for mommy? Can I get one motivational message for all the mommies that's going to see this message? What is one motivational message for mommy energy? One motivational message for mommy energy. I'm not taking all that. Give me one card, spirit. One motivational message for mommy. Thank you. I ask for help when I need it. You are not an octopus. You don't have eight arms to tackle every task at every moment. It's okay to ask for and accept help. After all, the more sources of love in your baby's life, the better. You're showing baby that the world is a friendly and social place and also teaching your child how to relate to others. When you reach your limit, be courageous and ask for help. You will bless the helpers and your baby more than you know. Okay. Big I walk with billions of mamas who came before me. Remember that billions of mothers have walked this path before you. Take comfort in this collective. Ooh, spiritual burping. The relentless nights, endless feedings, constant soothings when you're feeling weary, tap into other strengths. No, you can do this. You are doing this one step at a time. And by walking this road, you will bless other new mamas many years from now with experience, strength, and hope. Yeah. 
Can I get a motivational message for the father energy? Okay, running into this Can I get a motivational message for the father energy? That's it. Can I get a motivational message for the father energy running into this message? Thank you. My beautiful body is healing. It's hard to believe your body is healing when your hair loss and hot flashes make you miserable. Leaking booze, loose skin, and postpartum acne aren't helping either. But stop and think. Your uterus grew the size of a watermelon and shrunk back to a pear. You lost an entire organ placenta without skipping a beat. And while your brain may be feel like mush, it's actually grown in certain areas. Your body is a wonder. Treat it with kindness today okay so i feel like this is a reminder to men like don't put so much pressure and so much selfishness towards the woman who just had your child okay like this is a big transformation this ain't no just oh you had all nine months to get comfortable you was pregnant for nine months so like you just had a baby you should be fine now like no it doesn't work like that you feel me like and then also for my men who did probably go through some of the pregnancy symptoms with this no little to no morning sickness coming out. I don't know how that works. You know what I'm saying? But I have heard that men do go through morning sickness. But as far as like all the other things that was mentioned in this card, I feel like that was leaning more towards the woman having the child. And I feel like there is a sensitivity level that you need to be aware of in um and attentive to. Alright. In the reverse. I am present to what is. Soak it all in, mama. Your child will go from taking that first step to leaving for college faster than you can fathom. Then you'll be the one crying like a baby. Be present to precious moments. It may be the teenth time you nurse today or the seventh that we change, but look forward to the glorious and mundane. Now is where life lives and you don't want to miss it. Okay, so again, fathers, this is the men are providers type of thing. Okay, women are more the nurturers type of thing. But again, don't put so much pressure on the woman that you miss out on memories and things that you cannot get back with your child. Okay, like it's be as as active as possible, okay? Be as active as possible. This is not about just spending money. This is about actually being present, actually being active. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody can afford a child spiritually, mentally, emotionally, amongst financially. Everybody can afford a wife or a girlfriend or a mistress, spiritually, mentally, or emotionally. Like those things cost more than just money. That's why, again, the Nine of Pentacles is not enough. You got to come more than with just that. Okay. Now, keep hearing Tupac, devil playing tricks on me. The devil playing tricks on me. Okay. The bigger picture. We're going to get one clear message to close out this spirit of baby reading. And we're going to you know, probably wrap up the night. I don't know if I might do it. Yeah. He gets power to the weak and strength to the powerless. Isaiah 40, 29. Couldn't have said it better. Okay, God is not going to put more on you that you cannot handle. There is a reason why you met the people that you met, whether this is soulmate connections or twin flame connections. There was a reason why you your guys' DNA was put together because these are old souls coming back into this realm. You guys cannot just have kids with just anybody. So again, this is a test to get to learn the person that you are with while this person is pregnant or however. Or maybe you will be learning a lot about yourself through the, through this pregnancy. Okay? But However, when there's a will, there's a way, baby. 
All right, you already know it's my nation. I'm in the game. I'm in the pack. I'm in the taking over. Period. I hope you enjoyed your spirit baby reading. The time now is currently twelve twenty nine. April twenty. Oh yeah, you gonna be going through a time warp. You gonna look up and be like, damn. It was just this. Now it's this. You feel me? Um, when we started the reading, it was April 2nd. We ended the reading April 3rd. You feel me? So, again, pay attention to the small things. And also, whoever's out there struggling with this first pregnancy, get that tea, baby. Get that tea. And also, I'm hearing this tea, whatever herbs is in it, is going to be helping with these downloads. Oof. Oh, my eyes is itching and shit like crazy. Like, it's going to be bringing hella downloads. Um, all that detox and encouraging, okay? But yeah, I love you guys. Okay. Um, what's next?